Hello guys! So today I'm gonna have Cinnamon Roll on the video with me today because I kind of need her as emotional support. And when I say emotional support, I actually just mean some back support. <laughs> So obviously due to the current state of the world, I know that a lot of us are working from home, but I, like many others, actually still have to go into work every single day and keep the wheels of capitalism going, baby! So as I've stated in probably like every past video now, I have been working and living here in Tokyo for the past two years. I'm very lucky that every single company I've worked at, they've been very relaxed with their dress code. Even when I was working in office jobs, like they really didn't care if I like showed up in jeans or anything. I think that's due to the fact that that I mostly work at more international companies, so they're just a little bit more relaxed. But of course, every day when I'm commuting to work, I see salarymen in their business suits and women in their office attire. So I know that I'm kind of in a lucky position where I don't have to dress like full-blown office lady. But of course, you know, there's some rules like I have to dress a little bit more conservatively just for my colleagues and my coworkers. So I thought that I go ahead and show you guys like a hypothetical week of what I wear every day to the office. And these are actually actually outfits that I do wear to work and although I have a lot of freedom and like what I get to wear I do like to make sure I still look kind of presentable I actually want to feel like I'm coming to work and doing my job of course my first number one concern is comfort but then I also want to just look like clean polished, a little business casual if you will but mostly casual. I don't really dress too flashy when I'm at work, like the color palette that I go for for work is quite neutral. So as a working lady in Tokyo, here is what I would wear in a week. So obviously everyone hates Mondays, so I thought I'd jazz it up a little bit by putting on something a little spicy. Start with a bang! Shut them haters out, honey. Okay, sorry for the super extra intro, but that's just how we roll over here. But in all seriousness, I love this outfit. I wear it to work all the time because it is just so comfortable, but I think it's also really polished and put together and quite preppy. But I have on my tried and true black plaid Zara mini skirt that I've literally had for years with some black opaque tights to keep my legs warm and my black booties from Zara. But the star of the show is this Uniqlo cardigan. I actually have the same exact one in baby pink. But I saw this year they came out with this brown color and I had to get it for autumn and I think it's so cute. And to match the zipper detailing on the skirt, I just have on some silver hoops. As the Brits say, it's Tuesday, ain't it? So anyway, I have on this super simple outfit. It's honestly just a turtleneck sweater with jeans. And for whatever reason, it makes me feel so classy without having to put in a ton of effort, which I like. And also, it's just super cozy. So I got this amazing sweater from a store called GU here, which is like the sister store of Uniqlo. But the best part about this sweater is... BAM! Got your bum out? I don't think so. We're gonna hide that with the extra fabric because we ain't giving that out for free, you know what I mean? Alright guys, you know what time it is. It's Wednesday, my dudes! So here I have a super basic base outfit and I'm gonna dress it up by throwing on this beige blazer to kind of give it more of a businessy feel. But I still opted for jeans instead of trousers because I want to keep that laid back feel without making the outfit super formal. And of course, if it's chilly outside, you can switch out the tank top for a turtleneck or a sweater underneath. And my favorite part about this outfit is this belt. I thrifted this from Goodwill many years ago and it's still one of my favorites. And I just paired it with some cute pearl hoop earrings. And now moving on to Thursday. And here I have an all black outfit as a base, but honestly, this is super cute on its own. Obviously all black outfits are classic. But because we're moving into winter, it's getting a little chillier, so I thought I'd layer on top with this really cute grandpa-esque slouchy oversized sweater. And I have on some gold hoops to match with the little accents on my penny loafers, as you can see. Oh, hello, sis. But to make sure that this outfit doesn't look too grandpa-esque, I paired it with this black pleather skirt that I actually got on sale from H&M. And I feel like it just edges up the outfit a little bit. Oh my goodness, watch yourself. But yeah, I think it's a really balanced outfit. It's actually one of my favorites to wear and I just want to dance about it, you know? 
Now we finally made it to casual Friday and this is definitely the most casual outfit of the entire week. It's just a plain white tee with blue mom jeans and white sneakers. And I have this cardigan that you could kind of wear in multiple different ways. I even tried tucking it in the front for this preppy boy look, but honestly it made me feel way too much like early day Scott Disick, so I had to remove that as soon as possible. And I tried different looks and it just wasn't working, so I'm just going to wear it the way that I always do, and that's just to put it on all buttoned up, and then I go ahead and tuck those into my jeans, and don't be afraid to really get in there, because the end result is super cute and looks like this. I think it's such a sweet look, and honestly, I feel really lucky that I get to dress this casually <laughs> to my office, but I still feel like it kind of makes me look like I have my life together in a way. And this is another gem from Uniqlo. I love this cardigan. It has these cute kind of balloon sleeves and big buttons. And I also have on my blue light blocking glasses. This is really nice if you look at a computer all day. But honestly, I haven't been wearing them as much because when I wear a mask, it fogs up my glasses. And oh my word, look at the time. I'm going to be late for work. So I'm going to head out now. Toodle. So I hope you guys enjoyed these outfits and hopefully got some inspiration if you happen to work in an office that's really relaxed about the dress code but you still want to look presentable and let me know which outfit you guys like the best. And I swear the apartment video is coming very very soon so stay subscribed, put on the bell notification if you want to know when that's coming up and I hope you guys enjoy and I'll see you next time, goodbye!